using Spamzilla, let's see if we can find some expired domains, good expired domains, good deal that you can register. So once I found any domains here, I'll just get you register if it's still available. So I'm gonna check the data and let's see whether it's worth buying. All right, now before that, let's quickly have a look at uh, using the filter. So the first filter that we wanna use is go to just the uh, expired domain without going to the auction. All right, so we go to uh, here in the filter, we go to marketplace, you to select all, and make sure you just select this option right here. Go to the close cell. In that way, you will just see the result of all expired domain that you can instantly register. So that's the filter right there. And if you want to have some traffic, you can also put value right here in the ahrep traffic but i prefer not to because it will limit our search and also you can take this information right here if you want the domain to be already indexed on google but we keep it and take for now let's see this first filter let's do apply filter and here as you can see most of this if you see this icon right here you can instantly register these domains so let's say for example without looking at the data so here we go to this one, adopt the search that info. We copy this and we go to, uh, let's say GoDaddy and we type the domain here. When you search this, it says it's taken, but it should probably be available because as you can see here, expired domains register now. There could be someone who already took the domain. So let's grab this. Let's say, for example, this one right here, mostly this top ones already been grabbed. So let's see this. Again, it's been taken, but let's filter this uh, based on the FDR. Let's use this sorting right here. And as you can see, look at this DR right here. These expired domains have really high DR. And let's have a look if we can see pending delete. So I don't think this still be available, but you can see here the GoDaddy close out. So if you click this domain right here, let's say, for example, this dlwangju.com, let's click this. You can see here the GoDaddy closed out you will be able to buy this immediately so if you add this to cart and you buy this you can grab it as in now all right so let's take a look if we can get some data out of this domain so we go to SEMrush so you can when you are doing this you can sign up a free trial of SEMrush so that you will be able to use and find expired domain and see the data whether it's worth buying so you can grab the 14 day free trial and you go to domain overview and just up the domain right here. So sometimes you will see if you're lucky, you will be able to find keywords that are already ranking. It's pretty challenging to find keywords already ranking for this domain. If you use the filter that already expired, that means you'll be able to buy instantly. So most of them won't have the keyword data, but that's fine. You can go to Ahref, this free Ahref backlink checker, and then check this. You can see this domain rating is 70, all right? And you can check why it is having the 70 DR, and you will see most of the, uh, I think it's this domain has been populated with lots of unrelated bad things, which I think not worth buying. So although there's still potential that you just, we cannot tell exactly whether this domain already been penalized by Google. You can try because of the domain rating, which is 70, better than zero, better than starting zero. And you will see right here, this domain, it's available right now. So you can instantly grab this, add this to your cart and buy this, all right? Now, if you want to get those domains with already keywords ranking, and you want to see the data here in Ahrep, this is what you are going to do. So here in the filter, all right, select all these, or if you don't want to get confused here in the marketplace, again, deselect, and then just choose this GoDaddy auctions. These domains right here are premium, and you will get instant rankings if you are able to grab at least one domain. So you take that, and here we click this uh, apply filter, and you will see this. There are lots of domains here in GoDaddy auctions. So let's try one. So let's say, for example, this one right here, nowscore.co. As you can see, it has 62 domain rating. So let's take a look at the GoDaddy auctions. Look at this, guys. It's now in current bid is almost uh, three grand. Why is that? So we can copy this and paste that in our uh, SEMrush free trial. So you can do that and search 
And that is why it's almost three grand because instantly you will get 1,600 traffic. So if you go to keywords, so here, I think this is related to some sports data or sports information, soccer or multi-soccer. And you can recreate these keywords that are already ranking and get instant traffic. So you can do that. That's why this domain is almost three grand right now. So let's grab one more. This one right here, the new code. So estimated value is again, three grand and it, it just started. So it's it will last till 11 days and this could grow up again to almost this amount. And let's see if it's worth this amount. Let's see if we can get some good data from this domain. And we paste that here in our SEMrush. So here it's related to web design or web development. As you can see right here, as I can see CSS, gradient, images, things like that. So it's related to web design. So yeah, I'm not sure if it's worth 3K if it lasted for seven days. But anyway, maybe some people that are already bidding here already have the idea what they're going to do with this domain. Maybe they have a web agency that they want to rebuild and get instant traffic. Now let's get some more domain here, which we think worth buying. So let's take a look at this scarceclub.com and let's see how much it's been going now into the bidding. You can see it's just started. So bid will start with 25 bucks and it could go up to uh, $3,600. And let's see whether we can get good data from this domain. It is not ranking for any keywords right now. That's why it's not surprising why there's no one bidding at the moment because it's been running for two days, uh, almost two days now and no one bids it. So it is very important to check the data before you bid. Otherwise you'll just be buying the backlinks or the domain rating. Well, anyway, let's take a look. So you see right here, it's got 59 domain rating, which is really powerful. And you need to observe also the backlink, whether it's related to the domain. So you can do those reviews. So lots of factors you need to consider if you want to buy a successful domain. Guys, it's always a risk. You cannot just instantly buy a jackpot domain. You have to make sure you try everything. If I'm going to buy a domain, I don't want to go to auction because I won't be able to afford it. In auction, you need to have at least a thousand bucks in order for you to be successful beating the domain. So what I usually do is I come to this filter here in Spamzilla and I always just go to a GoDaddy closeout. And what I, the trick that I'm going to do here, here in the positions, I always put it as one. All right. So that means there is a chance of having the expired domain. So without going to the auction, this expired domain could have keywords that are already ranking. So we can test that. It's not guaranteed, but this is the filter you can, you can do. All right. Now you can take this Google index, but for now let's skip it and take because it will limit the result. Let's apply this filter. So again, you look at this, this GoDaddy closeout. These are the domain that you can instantly buy. Even this expired domains here, you can instantly buy this. You know why we're not able to buy it? Because some countries won't allow the TLD, for example, the .com, .net, won't allow you to buy those domains instantly. But let's say, for example, this .com right here, if you go to this here, you can instantly buy this domain right here for 19.95. So this expired domain right here has a DR39. Look at this DR39 and you can easily grab that. But sometimes it's okay. That's fine if there's no keyword already ranking. The important thing that you have to check is whether the backlinks already been spammed. And you can see there are some bad, really bad uh, backlinks already in this domain. But the fact that it has this domain rating 39, well, you can make it work if you are able to uh, originally grab what's going on in this domain in the past. So um, for now, guys, I think uh, that's all I can share with you. I'll be doing more of this. Uh, unfortunately, we're not able to find any of the good domains that I can share with you. Maybe the last one, this one, the powerpiece.com. Let's see. Wow, look at this, guys. You can buy this domain, but it's a premium one, 2,500. Why is that? We can, again, go to this SEMrush and see whether there are keywords. Look at that, guys. There are keywords, 29 keywords already ranking. And it's all about recipe for uh, vegan cookies, things like that. So you can get instant traffic if you are able to recreate this. And the good thing is this is a WordPress path. All right. But I don't think uh, this is worth buying for that's 583 unless it has at least 200 keywords or 100 keywords that are already in, within the top 10 of Google. 
So that's it for now, guys. I'll be doing more of this. So hopefully you, in the next episode, we can I can share you some domains that you can instantly buy. Um, if you are able to successfully buy a domain, you can check the link in the description below on how you can populate contents using AI. So it's very easy to follow and it's effective. That's about it, guys, for now and see you in the next one.